Congress is uh, considering pulling the plug on the uh, James Webb Space Telescope, which is the successor. Don't to get the me started. No, I want to get you started. This is the, the, the successor to the Hubble, and they say it can peer into the universe and maybe see the moment when the universe was born. I don't even know how that happens. Uh, but it costs $6.8 billion, which, by the way, the same amount that it costs to be in Afghanistan for one month. So either way, we're sinking money into a black hole. <laughs> um, but they're thinking of pulling the plug on this, and it just says to me, you know, why can't we, and I'm not usually a big supporter of these kind of things, but compared to Afghanistan, compared to the tax cuts for the billionaires, compared to it seems everything. like we won't do anything that's for the public good. Well, first of all, let's clarify what's, what the NASA budget is. Do you realize that the, the, the $850 billion, uh, uh, what was it, with the banks? TARP. TARP. Yes. Bailout. The bailout, the bank bailout, that sum of money could reach Venus. <laughs> <laughs> that sum of money is greater than the entire 50 year running budget of NASA. Wow. And so when someone says, we don't have enough money for this space probe, I'm asking, no, it's not that you don't have enough money, it's that the distribution of money that you're spending is warped in some way that you are removing the only thing that gives people something to dream about tomorrow. Do you, you remember the 60s? You remember the 60s and 70s? You didn't, you didn't have to go more than a week before there's an article in, 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 in Life magazine. The, the, the home of tomorrow, the city of tomorrow, transportation of tomorrow, all that ended. In the, in, in the 1970s, after we stopped going to the moon, it all ended. We stopped dreaming. And so I worry that decisions that Congress makes doesn't factor in the consequences of those decisions on tomorrow. Tomorrow's gone. You know what? We, we the, playing, the playing for tomorrow, metaphoric tomorrow, not the literal tomorrow. They're playing for the quarterly report. They're playing for the next election cycle. And that is mortgaging the actual future of this nation. The rest of the, the, rest of the world is going to be passing by. That's... It, it.